Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Corey Stark. Tonight, East St. Louis police are investigating a rolling gun battle that sent two women to the hospital. Officers want to find the suspects who drove away from the scene. News 4's Paige Holsey has new information from investigators. Dozens of evidence markers, at least eight bullet holes in this car, two shot out windows and shell casings from an AK-47 and a 45. That's what's left unseen after what East St. Louis police call a rolling gun battle just after six o'clock Saturday morning. We were at the station in the back parking lot. I mean, another officer heard the shots, but it sounded like they were coming from another part of the city. Then someone called 911. Once on scene, officers found a woman shot multiple times. She's stable. She was hit uh, twice in the lower area and once in the hand. Police believe the suspects that shot at her drove off, but they're also investigating whether anyone fired from inside the victim's car. Investigators believe this confrontation started elsewhere in East St. Louis. Those involved meant to get on the interstate, but ended up here on South Main. This evidence marker shows where the rolling gun battle started and then it ended farther down the road. The woman who was shot is expected to be OK. It's unclear if anyone else was in the car with her. Investigators will talk to the victim and see where this started and then go from there. A man in this red car was also taken into custody for questioning. And now police are looking for the suspects in the car they believe fled the scene. A red Ford Taurus, likely with damage from ramming the other car. In East St. Louis, Paige Holsey, News 4.